Okay, we're rolling. Everyone quiet on set. Shh. Everyone good? Craft services? No, it's, uh, it's literally just us. Uh, okay, welcome everyone to Private Chambers. Uh, so my name is Jared Stearns and I am Marilyn Chambers biographer. Um, working really on a cool. yeah, working on a biography about uh, the porn legend Marilyn Chambers, um, which we hope will be out uh, sometime in in time for the fiftieth anniversary of Behind the Green Door. And God, I love that. And uh, um, and uh, <laughs> and the Ivory Snow <laughs> scandal. And um, so with me is McKenna Taylor, yes. who is. I am Marilyn Chambers. I guess should I say Taylor or Chambers? I guess Chambers. Okay. Yeah. Marilyn was my mom. Yes. Um, so I'm super happy to be here with Jared and be a part of this amazing project. Yeah. That you've been working on for quite some time. Quite some time. Yeah. So I've been a fan of Marilyn's for a long time, more than a decade. Yeah. But um, working on the book for about two years and we've, we've been friends for about two years mm -hmm. and all that. So um, we actually meet um, we try to meet once a month, uh, either virtually or in person to catch up, uh, personally, and drink, um, some, wine and drink well. some wine. Yeah. This episode is not brought to you by, <laughs> by gift wine by Kathy Lee Gifford. Um, but I highly recommend, I hope we don't get a cease and desist. That would suck. Like, please stop using my wine. <laughs> um, but we thought that, um, when we meet, we, of course, catch up on what's going on in our personal lives, but we also talk about your mom. Yeah. And um, I think it was your idea to say, like, we should probably record these and maybe my mom's fans would yeah, like I, them. And I mean, too, like, yeah, we talk about you know, our own lives because we become friends. But talking about my mom is something that I obviously very much so enjoy. Yeah. And I know you enjoy it, too. I enjoy it, too. Um, yes. So it just has been a perfect, a perfect match, yes. I will say. Yeah. So... Over the coming weeks, um, we'll edit down these videos. We'll probably talk for about nine hours or so. <laughs> and uh, into sort of different sections. But today, so we'll start with um, I'm, probably the question you get asked the most by everyone when they find out that Marilyn Chambers was your mom. And um, my mother, the porn star. So, um, so when, so set the scene. Like, when did you find out that? Did she sit you down? Because my parents never sat down. My dad never sat me down and said, son, I'm a firefighter. Right. You know? Right. It's, yeah. It's definitely just, a different profession. Yeah. Almost yeah. like a warning profession for, for, hey, just a heads up, just in case. Right. Um, you know, when I was growing up, there was obviously, like, memorabilia in the house. And um, a funny story is that I used to tell people my mom was a singer. And my family always makes fun of me. They're like, do you remember when you used to say that? You say she's a singer and she she entertains people. And I always thought that was really funny because I had no idea. Right. Know, well, she did sing. And she did. You know, yeah. You can't put that down. Um, but, you know, as I was growing up and getting a little bit older and friends would come over, um, it started to become more of like a question. Like, who's Marilyn Chambers? Because that wasn't my last name growing up. Right? right, right. Yeah. And I'll never forget one of my friends was over having like a play date and she's like, Oh, hey, Dad, like, you could pick me up. You know, here's the address. And, and you know, as you're a kid, most parents are like, well, what's the parent's name? So I can formally, like, greet them. And she was like, Marilyn Chambers. And her dad was like, <coughs> I'm sorry? You're at whose house? And so I remember at that point kind of going, hmm, like, this is going to be, like, a question that pops up a lot. And my mom from, you know, since I was little would always say, like, if you have questions, like, don't ever be fearful to ask me. But... I will not overload you with things that maybe you're not ready to hear yet. Right. So I always really respected that. Yeah. Um, and it made me feel like, okay, it's on my time. And of course, I mean, as many people could probably imagine, I wasn't exactly super thrilled to be like, oh, my mom is yeah. doing X, Y, Z on camera. And I remember going, okay, well, I'm never going to know everything until I ask. And I remember we sat down and had a really great conversation. And then, like, that level of pride almost started to... And I was like, you know, in high school or maybe even a little younger. Yeah. And at that moment, I was still like, wow, this is really cool. Like, yeah. and it wasn't just because, you know, she was famous and she was on in movies and did shows and all that. But it was like, 
there's a totally other side to this, which is like the sexual revolution, loving your body, telling everyone I'm a woman and I can make my own decisions. So that was something that changed for me when I finally had that heart to heart with her. Yeah. Um, and then it also was great with certain things like being in college and writing a paper on the sexual revolution and like yeah. quoting your own mom. Like that's yeah. pretty awesome. Yeah. 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 Um, so, but yeah. And as I got older, I'd be like, yeah, my mom was an adult film actress yes. or also known as a porn, porn star. star.